Hey Jelly Beans! Kumusta kayong lahat? Oh my gosh, I'm so awkward in front of the camera. It has been forever since I last uh, posted a video on my YouTube channel. Life has been busy but it has been really good. So here I am again. <laughs> um, I'll try my best. Medyo bulol na bulol but Anyway, um, today I will be sharing with you uh, my Charles and Keith bag collection. So you may have seen some of them on my social media whenever I try to unbox things because I do love unboxing videos. But anyway, I was going through my things, cleaning my closet, and then I realized ang dami ko na palang Charles and Keith bag. So yeah, let's get to it. So, Jelly Bean, so just a bit of a story as to why I have been obsessing with Charles and Keith bags, apart from it's really good and the quality is really nice, is because when I was in second year sa college, I have this clinical instructor and she was bringing this bag to school. And I love at first sight ako sa bag because it's not something na, that I know in my mind na. It's really good quality and it was so classy, you know. And if you may have noticed, I'm into bags. So, but I could not actually pinpoint what's the brand ng bag because the brand it's not on the side or it's not at the front. There's no logo or anything. So parang ilang days ko din siyang chinak, chinek. So I may sound creepy, you no? Know? But there was one time na yung clinical instructor na minilagay niya yung bag niya sa table. And then I feel like that's my ano na, my opportunity to check what's the brand. So the one ako sa likod ng pa slowly. <laughs> and then dun ko nakita sa likod na Charles and Keith ang brand. So syempre nung time na yon um para bang um it's too foreign ang name ng bag. So tingin ko um this brand might not be in BQ or ICM. So parang Parang nilagay ko na lang siya at the back of my mind na, yeah, it's, it's too far out of reach for me. But um, when I was in, I think, third year college, we had um, an immersion sa Cebu for uh, psych uh, nursing. And then me and my friends went to SM. And that's where I found Charles and Keith Boutique. I was like a fangirl. I was just like screaming like, Oh my gosh, this was my dream bag and I am going to store just to check, you know, if ma afford ba ng 500 weekly allowance ko yung, yung bag. But then, nung, nung nasa loob na ako and then I was checking the bag, I realized it wasn't cheap. Like the prices would range 4000 to 6000 I was like, oh my gosh, hindi ko to ma afford So I was like, hmm... Yeah, maybe not now or maybe never. But God said never say never. And then a few years after, I have 10 Charles and Keith bags with me. So enough with the chica. Let's get into it. So the first bag that I have bought with Charles and Keith was way back 2021. So andito na ako sa UK and I was like earning decently. Um, the first thing that I like about Charles and Keith is that they have their own dust bag and I like na yung logo and the brand. It's not parang screaming at you na hey I'm Charles and Keith. I actually don't like bags na parang logo all over or yung brand easily spotted. Parang gusto ko yung low key lang but alam mo yung may dating and alam mo yung hindi siya Hindi siya pucho pucho, yung ganon. So anyway, the first bag that I've got from Charles and Keith is this Gabin bag. So it's in black and it's um, smooth leather. Um, the thing as well that I like with bags, no, like one consideration is I don't like yung very leathery. I like it smooth and I shine and shiny. I know that it's very prone to scratches, but that's just my preference. So when you open it, uh, actually it does come in a small one. And meron siyang gold hardware and just that. And then there's another compartment here at the back. So inside there's a small compartment and then a zipper bit. And then, 
that's it. So this is my first Charles and Keith bag. And you know what? Whenever I wear it to town or somewhere, I get really compliments and people asking me uh, about this bag. And as you can see, you won't really know the brand sa, sa front because there's nothing really you can see. It's just very small at the back. And that's what I like about it. It's just very low-key. So <laughs> that's my first bag with Charles and Keith. And honestly, I don't remember which is the second, the third. So I'll just go through it. Um, the next bag that I'll show you is this bag. It's in tan. I think that's the color. And that one. And it's also got another compartment right here. And you can adjust it if you want it shoulder bag or crossbody. So it's very like very minimalist. And the brand, as always, nasa likod lang. So that's the second bag. Third bag. <laughs> this one is like parang scrunchy bag and I really like it because parang it's just small, it's very handy and it's too pretty, you know, yung, yung mga aesthetics and everything and it does also got have its own um, crossbody na sling and that's the inside and just another small compartment right here. It just blends through with um, with your neutral outfits, really. And the brand, it's just on this side. Charles and Keith. So, it's small and cute. The white one. So, I decided na I needed something now for formal, formal thing lang. So, this one. And it does have a sling. If in case you wanted it to be like a shoulder bag thingy. And it goes well with any outfits too. Cute. The fifth bag I got, like when I saw this, when they have released it. Vitamin D? Or is it still vitamin D? When it, when it got released, I knew in my heart that I, I need to get it. And I'm not usually into black bags, but look at that. Isn't she pretty? <laughs> and this one is a magnetic um, lock. Not really lock. Yeah, it's a magnetic thingy. The thing that I like about this one as well is that it has a zipper on. So your thing's not really gonna fall off. It reminds me of that YSL bag really. But this one is way, way more affordable. And it does have a zipper on. So, yeah. She's a beauty, guys. Next up is, of course, <laughs> one of my favorite color. Isn't she cute? Like, when I saw this, I know in my heart that I need to get it. It's my first yellow bag, and just the color, it's not too very yellowy, if you know what I mean. It's just enough yellow, na very cute, very feminine. And I like the sling. It's my first time having a bag with this kind of sling. And of course, it's adjustable to crossbody and shoulder bag as well. And you can, you can actually fit quite a lot. So this one here, it's a magnetic flip flap. It's a magnetic lock flap. I don't know. And that's the inside. And then there's compartment here. Medyo na flat siya because I have brought this home sa Philippines when I traveled and dinam ko na lang siya sa malata ko with all the other heavy bits. So, that was a bad call. Huwag niyong kayahin. But, this one's really my favorite. Like, ah, it just screams sunshine, summer. And whenever I see it, it makes my heart so happy. Yes. The next bag that I got is, um, I think this one is the most expensive, honestly, if I have bought it here in the UK. Um, so I asked one of my friends, Marielle, Memshi, she got this for me in Singapore with way, way much cheaper. I think when it was first released because it was in their collection, so it's on the higher in, in the height on the pricey part i think they have priced this at 100 
110, 120 pounds. But when Marielle went to Singapore and bought this, uh, it was just 80 or 90 pounds. So it was so sulit. And it's just so beautiful, guys. It's the same as the gabbing bag, but this one is um, square. So this one is magnetic as well. And it also comes with a crossbody sling. And that's the inside. I think the reason why it's pricier because of the, the material, the leather that they have used. And then that. And I, uh, this was the bag I was using when I went to Korea. So, diba? And it just goes with any outfit. So, it's so, so pretty. The next bag I'll show you is the smallest Charles and Keith. And I think you've seen this quite a lot. So, um, I think this is the Koa in small one. And I got a mini, mini teddy. And his name is JK, of course. Um, this one, it also comes in a smaller sling. If you want it parang a bit of a shoulder bag. I got this in Singapore when we had a layover for about two hours. So I went to their shop. And um, I got it purposely because of nung kinasala ko, I need to have like a small bag that I can put my phone during the reception. And I have been grabbing this bag like very, very often. I can put my phone, lipstick, my rosary, bits of like just little things and it's just so perfect for me and the color is nice. This is the latest Charles and Keith bag that I have got and I got this in Seoul when I went to travel there. Um, I forgot how much it is. I actually forgot if it's expensive in Seoul or here. But for sure, it's much cheaper when you buy it in Singapore. So I have been looking for like a small backpack. And this is what I got. I got this in Myeongdong, Charles and Keith. Charles and Keith in Myeongdong. And yeah, it's actually, you can fit quite a lot of things inside. And it got a bit of a chain and that. <laughs> and of course, it's... It looks like my husband, so it's there. If you may have noticed, I am really into small bags. I don't really like big bags, but there's an exemption, and this is the biggest bag that I own. This is also from Charles and Keith, and the reason that I got it, I was thinking maybe if I'm gonna put my books or MacBook, or travel so I can put quite a lot of things and yeah it does it was really a good call so this one is made out of canvas and this is the leather bit and it's not heavy and you can really fit in a lot um, some people said you would need a divider but I actually don't have one but it's really a good one and you'll be seeing me wearing this in the next couple of months when I start my uni because this is really the bag to me. And oh my gosh, that's it. So that's the entirety of my Charles and Keith bag collection. I think I have shown you 10 bags. And in all honesty, I really like the brand. I like that it's trendy and I like its quality. And if I can just talk to that 17 year old girl in SM, who was like hoping to get a Charles and Keith bag but was just really shy to ask her parents because like seriously who would buy a kid like a 5,000 bag while she's still studying right it's just uneconomical but girl I would like to tell you now don't fret because we have a Charles and Keith bags that would last us a lifetime so parang nakaka amaze lang because you have this you are at a certain phase in your life na parang you were just wondering and wishing can I can I even achieve this can I get this and then a few years later after working hard and praying harder God's surprising you with like tremendous tremendous blessing and you'll just Realize when you open your closet, oh, from wishing of having one bag, I know it's multiplied to 10. Like seriously, how amazing is the Lord? So don't you guys give up if it's 
a car, or even a bag. Because like seriously, bag can make us happy. I don't know about you, but it made me happy. <laughs> so that's the end of this vlog, Jelly Beans. Thank you so much for the support. And I'm sorry for being MIA, but I'm here now. So I'll see you on my next vlog. Thanks again. Bye.